I think Neymar said a, a great sentence that before number 10 it was just a number and after him it was became something like a, something special. Every player, a top player, won a, won a award and number 10. In, you know. Just going back to Pele, was he the type of player that you wanted to be when you were, you were a young boy? My expectations were not so high. Absolutely <laughs> not. But, but I never it, pretend to be Pelé, honestly. <laughs> no, I but never. You, when you were growing up as a, a young When I was a boy, I never, I never saw him play. So I spoke with, for example, Menotti, and he said to me that it was pff, the greatest for him. So, uh, because he played with him, alongside with him, and and what he has done, not just winning, you know, three World Cups, like you said, well, how difficult it is. It's just the contribution and goals, and 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 and, and it was, I think, it was a new th thing when he he came up. But I, I was not born when when he was playing. But it's like a good movie, you know, with the legacy. When after many many years, still we are talking about him, still are talking about a good movie, a good book. Is because you are so good. You can be a short period, and I think uh, Pele, uh, Maradona, Cruyff, uh, uh, absolutely Messi, and Johan Cruyff, Beckenbauer, this type of of Cristiano Ronaldo, this type of players um, will be forever. Will be eternal. So, and of course, for the people who saw Pele, for the Brazilian people, I guess. Pelé had been the best. I understand. For Argentina, we see oh, the Stefano or um, Maradona, Messi. Uh, so everyone has uh, his own, and this is nice. So that doesn't mean one is better than the other one. So always I would say Messi is my favorite because I was with him and I, what he had done in 50, 70 years is unexpected, you know, scoring 40 goals every season, win, and everything. But I understand that people choose another one. What is the problem? <laughs>